education we say is the key to success. Yet we have tossed the key in the deepest oceans, blinding our hearts to its revelations. A tree for tea, on ne pas besoin de toi. Be gone. We don't need you. We'll find our way in whatever way we may. Nelson Mandela stated, and I vividly quote, education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. Yet, we have let down our arms and render our minds dormant, for we believe that there are other competing priorities, therefore, education can wait. It is written in the scriptures that the lack of knowledge causes a nation to perish, yet, we dare attribute our fall as a nation to anything else but the lack of knowledge. For we continuously refuse to invest in our minds and our sin to it that its gardens are turned into refuge dumps and the only thing we feed it is trash. Just as the body can never survive without its heart, so there exists absolutely no possibility of a developed Liberia if our minds remain undeveloped. And now I vividly see why Dr. Hammer Brown 2017's Independence Day orator stated, and I vividly quote, our peace will falter if our people remain uneducated and ungroomed. How then do we anticipate a better Liberia with a messy educational sector, as we call it? Just as the body needs food, so does the mind need knowledge. Well, though a person could succeed without education, but if you dare point me to a person who succeeded without education and still does not need an educated person on his journey, if he truly wishes to keep his success, I'll throw my pants away and feed my books to the fire. But till then, I never stop believing in the power of education. It's got a dear friend of mine. The drums in heaven are sounding. The rain has slowly yet painfully washed the tears from our eyes. It is time to invest in education, pick up our weapons and build our nation. It's never too late for reconciliation. Value our minds like we value our souls. Fill up classrooms like we fill up football fields. Feed our minds with book like we fill our lungs with air. This it's an age of enlightenment, a time for change, and the only thing that's to be changed is our way of thinking. Remember, there is no such thing as too educated, for the mind will continuously hunger for knowledge, unquote. Thank you.